In this moment, we're going to show you the third section of the Chisao. This third section of Chisao. Mira a far perdere l'equilibrio all'avversario nel primo momento. It makes your uh, opponent to uh, lose his balance. E lo posso fare in tre modi, io qui lo posso fare. Three ways you can do it this way. E poi respiro in due. Or push him back. Cambio. Or the other way. E respiro in due. And push him back. <coughs> Quindi abbiamo il lazzo e il bonzo. Il lazzo e il bonzo. Abbiamo questo movimento. Il movimento viene fatto con tutto il corpo. In using this movement of your a waistline to push okay. and bring your, your opponent towards you. If he does it towards him, this is the first attack. Using a, a forward motion uh, attack towards his face. Uh, his, he attacks with the attack of a manza with controlling his elbow. And this uh, throws his opponent off balance. He can also do another one like that. Tendo ad alzare con il braccio. Pazzo o Jack Chan. Jack Chan and a um, Manso. Manso will uh, actually, and your waistline will be able to uh, push your opponent away and de uh, debalance him. E il giro del corpo. All eh, together. Lui attacca. Uno, due, e poi la difesa. And the Come response to this is Chanzo. a, is a causa and a challenge Chanzo. now. Okay. Terza possibilità di attacco. The third possibility. In questa posizione. In this position. You can you can use uh, faxa movement to attack his throat. Se le mani throat. sono più strette, if, io faccio questo. If his modo. arms are very close together. Ma se quando attacco tu controllo il braccio, posso attaccare direttamente. And if he has space, he's able to go through between the two hands and attack his neck. Okay. E allora. The, the, uh, the defense the other person can, uh, can attack as they come back around and re-attack him. As you see here, he's moving his whole body and then re-attacking his opponent. Or directly instead of turning his whole body. Or also, or that. Those are the two possibilities of defense defending against this type of attack. Okay, these are the two possibilities of attack and defense. Un esercizio molto importante della terza sezione Ciso è il tre in pugno. One of the major um, components of the, the third section of Ciso is the trapping and punching. Tre in pugno. As you see Questo here, it's demonstrated. Le mani non si devono toccare. The, the arms cannot touch. The, the person who's touching, who's getting touched, should move his hand out of the way. As you see, this, this exercise helps with uh, trapping and punching and to defense against us. These are some of the errors that you'll see. One thing although, what is very important in the third section is in, a, in, in, in crossing your arms for defense. Left and right, right and left. Yeah, we have three different uh, types of uh, exercises. Posso andare con passo, Go porto giù, with the, with the di passo, porto giù, di oppure porto giù, bring it, his hand down, and come, and come up again, kind of like a rubber band. Uno, due, passo, uno, due, uno, due. Altra possibilità è il gas. The other, other possibility is to, is to trap him and... Quindi abbiamo tre punti, uno, due, 
and a lower punch. So, two tacks above and one below. And this is this section uh, helps with the uh, trapping and this section helps, help us, happens uh, to help you with your trapping and your punches together, also with the de de debalancing your opponent. Okay, poi vedremo altri pezzi altre volte. This concludes our. Okay.